A Salem neighborhood is under siege by a group of teenagers. They started out looking for extra credit and ended up with a 1,200-pound medieval weapon. News Channel 8 photojournalist Alex Lynch went in search of a different sort of summer fling. <laughs> and there's a lot of creaking and stuff. It sort of evolved, you know, we, we started off pretty small. And then it got really big, and then it, <laughs> it kind of made me a little nervous. Okay. Probably 1,200 pounds right there. <laughs> Anything could set it off, basically. I'm Chris Ewing, and my friends and I have built a trebuchet. It's a trebuchet. It's a trebuchet. A, it's French, I don't... It's a household word at my house. It's a six-pound ball of lead. All right, uh, we're, Five, we're shooting here. Four, three, two, one. So, yeah, we've got neighbors outside. We generally ask them about this point, can we shoot the trebuchet, you know, after we've <laughs> shot once. Hi. Hey. Hi. Just wanted to make sure <laughs> the neighbors down there have a greenhouse and they don't want bowling balls crashing through the. Uh, the neighborhood's been well aware of the uh, project since it started. We couldn't quite tell what it was, but things are coming like all the way over, you know, into the trees. Uh -huh. And it was a little startling at first, but. <laughs> the eight pound jug of water, that's, that's always a crowd pleaser. My mom doesn't want it here any longer. So we didn't really know if we could do it. <laughs> <laughs> it's Mr. Hannock's, uh, his uh, honors physics class for uh, extra credit. <laughs> Guys, I'm on the ground. Yeah, All right, ready, Tom? Go for it. Pumpkins up to 20 pounds. Dummies. Dummies. <laughs> Actually, it's in the trunk of my sister's car. And... So, it doesn't have a head. <laughs> Cock it, load it, shoot it. Do we have half a watermelon up there? It goes pretty fast. Can I get a 10 second countdown? Did he say wait 10 seconds? Oh, that's a deep one. The A is across the board, I think. We forgot to put somebody back here. It's going to be hard to find it. <laughs> and yeah, they did get the extra credit. They're going off to college. Oh, the big question is, who gets the trebuchet in their dorm room? You, you did that stuff for extra credit, didn't you? No, I never did. <laughs> Wish I would have done that, but I'm trying to think, hmm, is there any place in the backyard? If they You're need ready the, to build one? I'm ready to build one, but there's no way we can put it in my backyard. That's a great story. We've seen it around here all night long, and it just gets better we, we and like better and it. better. That dummy didn't fare so well on the trebuchet, did it? Dummy didn't do too well, <laughs> but I'm loving the eight-pound milk jug going. I'm liking that theory. Hey, if you need a place for the trebuchet when you go to college, boys, I think Dave wants it. No, oh, I would love to have it. The problem is there's no place in my backyard. However, we... No, it wouldn't work there at all.